Success. City Connection. Dispatch Games. Oh, hello everybody. Welcome back. Dace here. And guess what we're checking out today? Oh man, something I have been waiting months for. Cybariar Delta for Nintendo Switch. And already I'm loving the colors, the visuals that are going on right now. Just crazy. The whole game is like this. No, I'm just kidding. Um, but yeah, anyway, just uh, as we're watching this, I'll just chat for a minute. This is something I had ordered on PlayAsia months and months and months ago. And it was uh, on the same order as something that was pre-ordered. Um, and what happened was that pre-order item just kept getting pushed back month after month. And so did everything that was uh, with that order, um, or that item. So eventually I contacted them. I was like, hey, is there any chance of just like shipping the other stuff since uh, it's been like a long time? So we got that. Um, we got two copies of the Stardew Valley Collector's Edition and this, which I've been wanting to play this and check it out for the like just so long, months and months and months. So anyway, this finally showed up today. Oh, sweet sound and awesome screen. I love it. Just all the, the cold blues and the purple, oh, okay, so, normal game, I think we can just, oh, already really, really impressed with the sound effects, oh, so good, so we're just going to jump into a normal game, um, and see how this goes, interesting, so we got this ship, I'm thinking we're gonna go with this guy. Version. Okay, so at the bottom we got like the Delta, Medium, or the Revision. I'm thinking since we're. I'm, I'm thinking we'll just check out Delta first. Sound. Yeah, we'll just keep everything. I have no idea what this is supposed to be. Um, but. Let's just jump in and check it out. I'm, yeah, I'm really, really excited. And I'm glad to be sharing this with you guys. Whoa, party central, you guys. Planet Earth, okay, so. So there is, um, like as you can see, we're getting like buzz. It's kind of like to me, it's the same the same idea as like the grazing in other games. Um, but from what I understand, you level up by grazing or buzzing. And if you don't know what that is, uh, it's essentially like being very close to enemy fire, just close enough that you're grazing it, more or less, but not that it's actually hitting. Interesting, okay, that seems to be the first stage. Oh, man. Ooh, interesting. So do we want to do desert or... Wait a minute, uh, let's just check. Whoa, what's going on? No, 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 no. We want to stay on... Oh, I see, okay. Um, I'm really feeling the forest. You guys know me, I love forests. They are fantastic. It's great because for those who, like for instance, uh, Don Maku Unlimited 3 is a game I love, and that has the grazing. Oh man, I think I just got hit. That has grazing in it. Ooh, yikes, I did just get hit. Um, but it's not that you have to graze, but I love the fact that this really, really encourages you just to do that, more or less, because of the whole leveling up that you actually benefit 
way more. Like, uh, it seems to be, like, outside of the realm of chasing scores. Uh, there's, there's just that level up aspect. And, uh, I think that's just really fantastic. Oh, yikes, dude. Oh, dude. Okay, we're gonna continue. Um, pay closer attention. I was just gonna like weasel my way in between those two, but that did not pan out. Sweet. Yeah, one thing I really like is that uh, on the right side in the middle, of course, you have like a player close up. Um, to be honest, I'm not sure how practical it's gonna be to look over and pay attention to that and then switch back. Maybe it'll be a cinch, but. Um, I, what I like about it, at least, is if you do get into the habit, then you can just kind of, like, just have, yeah, that much more of a close-up, pay attention to weaving in and out of very tight, um, situations with a little more clarity, so that's really cool. Cloud Bank, Asteroid, I'm thinking Cloud Bank. And I'm loving the colors, just like all these sweet neons and things. Oh no, what was that? Oh dude, come on. And just the enemies, the look of these enemies, oh. This is so cool. Oh, I ran into that dude. Come on. Okay, we're just gonna bomb them. Bomb them to bits, you guys. Oh! I didn't tap over far enough. You gotta be kidding me. gonna be too hard on myself because this is my first time playing this and uh, just getting used to the, the attack patterns and all that kind of stuff. Oh yeah, so cool. Oh yikes. I was in a, or I was about to be in a safe spot, but I just fumbled it. Just fumbled it big time. Crazy. But yeah, so far I'm really, really enjoying this. This is super, super cool. I would be interested in seeing just what some of the, the top scores are. I'm sure there are just people who just go over the top with this game. Maybe even those who played this, because I think the original came out um, like way, 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 way back. Uh, so this seems to be the only level we can do, so we'll just we'll go here. Okay, party is st oh! I was about to say the party is starting, but obviously not. That. Oh, stuff like that is so, so good. I love it. Okay, let's just use one of those guys. Just clear the field a little bit. Oh, crazy. Oh. Nice. 
place. Warning, the area target Trigon is approaching fast. I would love to actually... Oh, sweet! Whoa! Oh, be getting in here because... With that side shot, we might as well be putting that to use. But at the same time, I don't want to compromise our... Aw, oh, come on, dude. Our situation. Oh, seriously? No! Just get away. Maybe I really ought to be using that close-up because yeah seriously but at the same time i really don't want to get in the habit of oh it's like glancing over and then back and i can just be oh like seriously Crazy backgrounds, too. So fantastic. that. Oh. Oh, I just nicked me. Not where I want to be. Let's just bomb those guys to bits. get practice though and not just constantly dying like holy smokes and I just thought to check like in Danmaku how you can hold down the trigger and have a concentrated burst I only thought to check that now and that's what we can do so that's pretty sweet what else can we do? Um, let me just focus on getting out of that. There we go. Ah, oh, come on. Oh, did not want to be in that situation. <laughs> Oh, yeah, right. Come on. He was like a, a sliver of health left. So silly. And you guys know me. Like, I don't I don't like looking up too much before playing it for the first time. So, yeah, like, we're 15 minutes in and I just realized about the concentrated burst. But that way it's just like, oh, yeah. Like, that's so cool that we can do this. Epic. Okay, so wild. There you have it, guys. Um, that would be a run. That is, uh, interestingly enough, a very, very, very short uh, shmup. But obviously, I think the thing to keep in mind here is that, like, the focus is very, very much on, yeah, just score chasing. 
Um, which I don't mind, because, like, not all the time I want to be playing shmups. Well, or rather, I'll rephrase it. Like, not every shmup has to be, like, this 30 or 40 minute run of, like, nine levels or whatever the case is. Um, I think, uh, yeah, this is fantastic, too. And I'm really, really stoked to, in ways, kind of use this as a grazing practice game. Like, just... Because of the nature of this game, I feel this would be ideal for just improving that skill in general, which can then be applied to whatever other shmups I play, which have grazing or buzz or whatever the case, whatever they're calling it. Um, so I like that a lot. Simply by playing, you can just be improving. So yeah, I'm thinking we could check out the other ship because why not? So we're just going to finish these credits which I'm assuming won't be super super long but we'll see <clears throat> excuse me and maybe we'll take another look at the menu in case there are other things because we didn't really look over that too much um, but yeah who knows maybe there are challenges just different whatevers to go over but overall I'm actually really really pleased with what I've experienced so far. Um, yeah, I missed out on getting the uh, special edition or limited edition or whatever it's called, but I'm very thankful that I was able to track down or that they still had the standard edition. Um, because yeah, they won't be around forever, but uh, you know me, I love snagging my shmup physicals for Switch. It's, yeah, one of my favorite things. What a solid, solid experience. Yeah, crazy. Now, obviously, we used so many continues there. But uh, like I always say, like first time checking things out and yeah, sometimes there is just, yeah, a blast worth of stuff that you just don't anticipate or you just have no idea what the patterns are gonna be like. We'll just go like that. Cool, okay, well anyway, um, let's go like this. So yeah, um, let's just take a quick gander. So yeah, like I did read over these, but I wasn't really retaining anything. So ranking, score attack. I wonder what that is. Probably just, yeah, whatever. Um, okay, so maybe there isn't as much. We can at least go in here and see what's up. Okay, I'm thinking what I'll do is just do another normal run and we'll use the other ship. So, uh, go like that. And maybe... Maybe we'll do revision and see what that's all about. And maybe for this we'll go medium unit. Yeah, right. Okay, I'm just getting used to the very, very peculiar shape of this ship. Oh, I thought I might be able to just sneak in there. Yeah, that's kind of that's kind of throwing me off, to be honest. Um, not that I mind it, but it's just it's different. Like it's so so strange that I'm not even sure. Like, is it gonna register if it's just the wing, or does it have to be like the central 
narrow part of the ship for buzzing. How about... Well, we did the forest last time. We might as well just do the desert and see what that's like. Even though I'd rather not do something easy. Overall, like, I'm not super crazy about, like, the ship doesn't really look like anything mind-blowingly cool, and neither do the enemies, really. Um, I'm not so much crazy about the, the art direction in this game, but as for the attack patterns, those are gorgeous displays, and just in general, I think this is fantastic. Super cool. I like. Okay, I actually do like this guy. This guy looks sweet. Oh, as if. That's a really cool... Oh, just watching it move like that. So good. Yeah, nice. Okay, we'll do Asteroid because we didn't do that one yet, as far as I know. And ideally, let's see if we can do better than we did last time. Even though we're new, let's see if we can use less continues this time around. Oh. I just love that it really, really does encourage you to, yeah, just go for those buzz. kind of just like taking the, the, uh, the sights but yeah just going for those buzz moments like when you see a nice thick wad of shots like you just want to you just want to be there lapping it up whoa that one was actually easier to avoid but i just fumbled it at the last second Two twenty-seven buzz. I'm sure that's nothing to be like so hyped about or anything, but Ooh, okay. Oh, zero space. Okay, we're gonna go to a zero space. Interesting. Ah, oh, we're just moving a little too slow. Nice, 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 nice. Okay, I'm gonna go like that just to clear the board a bit. There was a little too much going on there. More than I felt like uh, dealing with anyway. 
right at that moment. This thing looks huge. What on earth? Oh, I did not. I was not even paying attention to that big ass beam. I was paying more attention to looking at the little the little blasts he was doing. Okay, so we don't want to be... We can really cash in on the, uh, the buzz beside the beam. The, oh, so cool. Come on, man. And you guys also know, like, I'm a big fan of multi-stage bosses, so this is really sweet. Or, yeah, multi-phase, whatever you want to call them. Even if it's not, um, like, the boss morphing into like a new look and shape and all that kind of stuff even if it's just like a different set of more aggressive attack patterns like whatever the case is there we go Okay, here we go. Oh, I did not just get hit there. You gotta be kidding me. wondering if he was going to sneak in one more attack before I took him out, and that's exactly what he did. I do like the blue colors they used for that ship that just went to the left side. Oh, no way! I was so sure I wasn't going to get nicked by that. Okay. Let's do this. Oh, yeah, right. Okay, we're just gonna do that too. Oh, dude. Okay, so based on the uh, little list of scores on the bottom right side, I'm wondering if there's a way to do more levels uh, because it, it keeps track of like as you go and there were some empty sections there. So I'm wondering if there's a specific route so that you can just cash in on more points because you're going through more levels or whatever the case is. 
But yeah, that is Savaria Delta for Nintendo Switch. Um, I'm thinking that's actually a great place to leave off, you guys. Uh, like, I, I don't want this to be too long. I could, I could easily keep playing. But uh, like always, it's so good to have another shmup to get into the stream rotation with all the other amazing ones that we've got here. And I can see this one being a lot of fun, just getting more and more practiced. I do feel like we did better that time in terms of using less continues, so that I'm gonna go back um, after I stop recording and actually check just to see. But I just feel like that went way, way more smooth. Um, so it's great to see that progress already. Um, but yeah, anyway, you guys, thank you so much for checking this out with me. Um, it's always a treat having you guys here for the ride and the action. And, oh man, definitely let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Whatever you want to share. Always love uh, getting into chats with you guys or whatever the case is. Um, it's always a pleasure. This time we're not going to let the, the credits roll all the way to the end. But, um... Yeah, overall, I'm really, really, really pleased with this purchase, and yeah, that'll be it. You guys have an awesome one. Thanks again, and we'll see you next time.